I still have to save this shit game. I'm not ready yet. You can go fuck yourself right away. All right, now I'm ready. Now let's play. Well, this is absolutely unnecessary. Like in every meaning of the word, this is completely uncalled for. There is no reason why this should even be a thing. Like if the environment is gonna be a douchebag, I should be allowed to reset myself. Because if the environment's gonna be a douchebag, I should have that right. I should have the right to not get screwed over by the fucking environment. What a shitty ass game this is. Fuck off, I don't care. Well, I had no commentary to begin with, and now I gotta start a whole fucking race over, so... That means I need even more fucking commentary, which I don't have any of at all whatsoever, thank you very much. I have another recording day on Tuesday, so it's not like I exactly need to exasperate everything that I have right here, right now. And I think I might just give this up. I might just give up on completing this right now. Because the next session, undoubtedly, I'll be able to finish this shit, but I'm just... Because all I can think about right now is food. But I can't eat, because I don't want to eat. Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah, don't make me do this. Fuck you. Ugh, fuck off. Yep, of course. Redneck Joe is just on Redneck Joe reporting for duty to make everything that much more fucking complicated. Thank you, Redneck Joe. Your service is always appreciated. Ugh. I can't believe that I... Uh, I go through a, over a week of my life and I have nothing to say. Nothing to say at the end of it. At the end of it all, I have nothing to say. I was gonna read another day. Could I fucking have memory, maybe? I'm literally incapable of remembering anything. I'm absolutely incapable of remembering anything. See, I could have some commentary. I could find something in that book and talk about it, but no, I'm just gonna continue having no commentary whatsoever. And annoying ass cop chases that just never end. We're gonna be level three by the time this race is over. My fucking god, we're gonna be level three. What a load. What a calm load of shit. <laughs> yep, of course. Spawn them right where I'm going. Go right ahead. Where'd I get fucked over? When did that happen? Am I past the point where I got fucked in the ass for no reason? Or is that still coming up here? Wow, thank you for that. That really helped. I've already talked all about Need for Speed Carbon. I've already discussed everything that makes that game a pile of shit when it is a pile of shit, not a pile of shit when it isn't a pile of shit. Yeah, all I can really think of is food. I didn't even finish talking about what I was eating yesterday, because I had that Subway shit, and then I had, uh... A donut question mark? Did I have that yesterday or was it the day before? I think I had one yesterday, yeah. And um, after that was some yogurt. Some oikos. The best shit in the world. Listen to me right now, YouTube. Eat Dan and Oikos. It is fucking delicious. And you will not regret it. Now here's where I got fucked up. Oh my god, move your bitch ass. Any bands to hit me head on? No, actually, that is surprising. Oh my god. There certainly are some water barrels to hit, that's for damn sure. Yeah, all I can think about is food. And did I eat anything else yesterday? Was that it? Was that the extent? Of course, there's a cop right here, because of course. 
because this race doesn't need to end or anything. No. Uh, ah, two more. Just dab on, why don't you? Dab on. I think that's all I ate yesterday. I haven't not ate in a long time. I'm so used to eating. Again. Like, it's so great being able to eat again, but I'm getting fat is the problem. Like, I'm not doing enough at work anymore. Like, before it was fine. Like, I was losing some weight. Well, I was actually maintaining. But now it's back up again because, you know, of course, there's a fuck off. And I burned 150, maybe 200 calories on the treadmill yesterday. I mean, no, was that two days ago? But that doesn't matter, because I fucking stuffed myself that day. I had an entire bag of chips. An entire bag of tortilla chips. The entire bag. I haven't actually weighed myself since before that, so I don't know if I want to find the horrifying discovery that I'm at, like, 185 again. Like, if I go back up to 180, I will cry. And that is actually grounds for starvation, because I'm not going to weigh 180 fucking pounds again, I swear. Because I was at 180. I was at 185. That was... So, I don't think. right before something. It was like sophomore year of high school. I was 185. And it was terrible. No, let me end the pursuit! I don't care! Uh, just let it end. Just fucking let it end. No? Okay, fine. We won't let it end. This time. Maybe just maybe. I'll get it here. Come on, come on. There we go. Hiding spot. Fuck this game. Anyway, yeah, I was 185. Like Christmas of 2013. Yeah, 2013. And then, um, bye. And then I weighed myself again New Year's Day on 2015, and I was still 185. And I'd gotten up to like 192 at one point, and I was like... is complete. Yeah. Which means it's time for another toll booth, maybe? Maybe another toll booth? Maybe just another toll booth? Or how about a speed trap? Let's just, let's just get the maximum one out of the way so that if the cops do decide to shove their asses into the situation again, then we can get rid of them right away and then hopefully the last three races don't have any cops at all. So everything will be okay. Yeah. And then I worked my ass off in 2015. 2015 was a good year. I was in the best shape of my life. I ran a mile in seven and a half minutes. I was proud. Yeah. And by the end of that year, I was 165. Now it's all, now we're halfway through 2016, and, um, well, 
I'm not 185, so that's good. I don't know what I am. Maybe I'll just do, I'll stop mid-session and we'll find out here. And see if I need to starve myself for the rest of the day, because that's what I was planning on doing. I was planning on not, I was planning on eating just what I did yesterday, and then not eating at all today. Because I've got this to do, and three hours of work. FUCKING MOVE! Because I've got this to do, and I've got a haircut, and then I got uh, three hours of work. So, and it's on three hours of, well, you know what? Friday is buy at the fucking store Friday. I don't know if I've ever discussed this in a series, but I have names for every day of the week. They've changed considerably over the years, but some of them have stayed the same, such as monstrously busy Monday. Terribly busy Tuesday, wacky Wednesday, because Wednesday is weird in that sometimes it's slower than fucking hell, and other times it's it's a fucking day before Fourth of July kind of fucking vibe. And then there's tremendously busy Tuesday, buy out the fucking store Friday, and those are the ones that remain the same. I don't have a name. I, I've really changed the names over the years for Saturday and Sunday. Because Saturday is stupidly slow Saturday, because no one goes to the store on Saturdays. And Sundays are fuck my life Sunday, because I hate working on Sundays, and they're always fucking busy. And no one else wants to be there. And for some reason, people decide to buy fucking 70 gallons of water. Yeah, that's annoying. That's not annoying at all. Oh, hey, here's some also some more unmarked Pursuit Breakers that you never use because you never go up here. Um. Okay, let's do one more sprint here. 